Let's do this. <sighs> Give me that machine gun. Are you sure why not? Barely gets any love. Something. I'm just gonna ignore those. Oh, guess I'm not ignoring that. Yeah, I could. I could have totally done that. What? I, I'm just seeing. Like, could I have theoretically won that uh, match I had to do for Arcade Pit? And yeah, I theoretically could because of how close it was. It was like a second apart. So if I had just done a few things differently, I could have totally won that. But eh, hindsight's 2020, as they say. Oh, oh god damn it. And that's why I don't like doing that. Cause that happens. And it bugs the shit out of me. Hell yeah. Ah crap. Let's do it the slow way then. Well, we should be able to get another spreader in stage two, so is, is that the worst thing? I don't think so. Just time consuming as shit! Top down area. I need that spreader back. That's not the spreader. That's not. I think that is. Yes, it is. All right, enough trying to do stupid shit. If I really want to make sure I'm prepped for arcade pit next time, I'll I'll just do that on my own time instead of uh trying to experiment here. I love being able to just mash the B button and win games. It's good. And it's amazing. Uh oh. Bad time to scratch my head. Oh uh, yeah, bomb. I don't know if it's worth any points, but for a second I thought I was not going to be able to grab it. Awesome. Just going to run past you two. And this should be the boss. Done. Stage two down. The early stages I remember pretty well in Super C. It's the it's the late game stages that are gonna be a problem, as I recall. Area three. Yeah, I remember this stage. I remember area four. I kind of remember area five and six. But beyond that, I don't I don't remember this game. I do believe it's an eight-stage game, however. If I'm not mistaken. Oh yeah. I'll take it. I believe the caution game is what we are playing today. Mid boss? That mid boss should be coming up soon. Machine gun. Ew. Think I want that? Bye! Laser. Nope. Hey, the only weapon that I need is my spreader. 
The fire weapon's not that bad either, and machine gun's always a nice go-to if you can't uh, get the spreader. So there are choices that you can make if you don't want spreader. Luckily, with the water, as long as you're ducking in the water, nothing can kill you. Okay, that's the sign we're nearing the mid-boss. Let's do it. Just gonna hit you right on you. I don't mind. I believe this is what we call caution. Got him. I like I just kill him, but whatever. Okay. Walk backwards so we can fix that camera. Because God knows I do not want to put up with a BS camera. I'll take the barrier. So rule of thumb with this, if a single platform sinks, not all the way... The next one is, uh, hell yeah. Uh, the next one's unlikely to, or it's likely to sink all the way. It's a common rule of thumb I use. And they trick you like that, and that should be all of it. Should just be the boss from here. Yep, that guy. Fuck! Finger slipped on the A button. And the rest is, as they say, history. Alright, well, this got fun. Got one. I mean, if you stay in the right place like I am here, at least these two here can't do anything to you. But the top one, the bottom one. And once you kill all four of them, there's not a whole lot the boss can do. Alright, area four. Not having a spreader for the majority of this stage sucks, but I do believe we'll get a spreader somewhere in here. These bubbles, I believe they gave you a fair amount of points, so they're good for stocking up on lives. For that reason! Hello, enemy with a gun. Nice to meet you, too. By all rights, I really should not have taken some of the deaths I took. Like, the death I took in stage one was really dumb. Uh, and then, what, one other death in stage three? And that's been all my deaths. Like, it's only two deaths. Unless I've forgotten about... Well, I guess I'm not forgetting about that death. By all rights, I should be at this point without having died, but... You know what? I'm gonna blame it on rustiness. Because I don't... I personally think the game does not get difficult until stage five. Stage 5 is the point where I'd say that you should be having problems. Unless you obviously know this game. Like, if you're only just starting to play it, then I guess the, uh, some of the early seniors can give you problems while you try to learn, but they're not too difficult in the long run. Stage 6 is especially pain in, in the ass, because that whole stage is basically just RNG the game. And it's awful. Okay. You have a small ish break. I didn't say it was much of a break.
I mean, we might as well be holding down the B button. There's gonna be some point where we can get a spread it back. I think it's here. Yes! Oh, give me back that beautiful bastard. Now we're in business again. I believe when we reach the top of this elevator, it's going to be boss time. That sounds right in my head. And I expect when we kill him, we'll get an extra life if we only get an extra one by, uh, by the time we reach him. Alright, boss. Let's fight. Yeah, we need to at least kill a few of these things so we've got a little bit of maneuverability. Done. It's actually kind of funny seeing the uh, slow explosions because he's partially off screen. Area 5. How do you feel about climbing? It's always that one Contra stage that has climbing. And it delivers in this stage. Oh god, does it ever. Oh shit. Okay, we're fine. Well, we're sort of fine. We can just duck here. Ah shit. Yeah, I, I realize my problem. No, you don't. Problem is gonna be what? Ooh, God! Must nail me. The problem is gonna be. Also, we didn't get an extra life from the boss. Dang. We have to be close to uh, a life, extra life. Oh yeah, give me that R. We got jetpackers, which aren't too bad because of our spread. There's the extra life. They're not too bad because of the spreader. However. Is it here? I'm trying to remember if it's here. Here it is! Rocks! Your worst enemy. Yeah, that's a rock that just decided to fall down there. If, if you don't know where that's coming, you'll just jump and that thing will nail you in midair. I hate that thing so much. All right, now do I remember the rest of the stage? Probably not. Yeah, guys can come out there. And also that guy can appear. So really they can come from either which direction. So take your pick. Yeah, I knew you were going to be there. I just knew it. Boss time. It's a flying UFO. Fuck. I thought my spur was going to be able to get you. Well, fortunately, I'm sort of familiar with fighting this guy, p sure only because it's an arcade pit challenge. Sucks I had to lose my spreader to him, but not much I can do about that. <sighs> Alright, stage six is the one I was not looking forward to. So, let's see how well or how poorly it goes. I am almost 100% certain at one point or another, I will be taking a death in stage 6. Because of one specific part. But, uh, if you missed... Uh, yeah. Ah, fuck. Okay, this is bad. So, uh, these mouth enemies, they just show up wherever they feel like. So I'll just show up right on top of you, and there's nothing you can do about it. Might as well kill these guys, so we have free range of fire now. Sucks that I also was not able... Please, please, yes! Alright, well, it's likely only going to be temporary, but... Hell yeah. Taking that bomb. 
Really, you just gotta be on your toes. Son of a bitch. Alright. Where's the death I thought I was gonna take? I mean, it's just a gate. That guy, anyway. Now what? I think this guy is actually the boss. So, never mind. This stage wasn't as bad as I thought was. Assuming this is the end of it. Which it's probably not. This is probably just a mid-boss. But I'm pretty sure otherwise this is the end of the stage. As in, like, we're gonna have to fight another boss right after this guy. I think. Am I right? Yep. Sure enough. <clears throat> the actual stage boss. That guy. Well, there's a little henchman dude. He's also very easy. Okay, so I can beat that stage without dying, because... I could have avoided damage. That... Outside of the RNG section, the section that I did die, I'd say, is the hardest part. Alright, Area 7. Oh, fuck. Do I remember how this stage goes? I probably don't. Ah, fuck. I've got, like, no good weapons now. Stop turning around! And stop moving forward. Uh, at least I can kill those things with relative ease. It's just a mash fest. I know it. Some. I'm pretty sure at some point, uh, there's gonna be a weapon drop. I don't know what point it's at, though. Is it here? Fuck off! I know, I think... Yeah. Drop down here. Oh, but now I... No. I, I hate the laser weapon. It's not worth it. Ah, fuck. Alright, there goes those weapons. So now we get to do the rest of this stage without uh, anything but our pea shooter. I don't even remember what comes next. Mmm! If I remember where weapons are, we would be having less of a problem. We'd still be having a problem, but... At least we'd ha be facing that problem with some sort of weaponry. Okay. This is the safest thing we can do. Because it takes that guy out without us having to go down there, and then we just have to worry about you. Uh, however, it looks like we're not... Oh, no. Maybe we will be. Isn't this exciting? Oh, fuck. Now I'm missing. Oh, I think I just took it out. It just didn't explode. That's interesting. One down. Now, other one down. Okay, I'm not going to be as lucky this time. Yeah, we, we're going to have to fight this one head on, but that's fine. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not fine. Is this the boss? This is the boss. I mean, I know I have to do this, but what else was there to this fight? Oh, that. Yeah, how could I forget that? Fuck. They were just perfectly synced up to uh, kill me. Will you die? Thank you. Took your sweet time dying, I see. <sighs> well, 
Last stage. Fuck. What do I need to know about this stage? Uh, okay, well, I know what weapon I'm getting now. Thank, thanks for narrowing it down for me, game. I'm taking these guys down. Because they'll give me some points. And it's going to just be less trouble for me. If I don't have to worry about all this everything trying to kill me. R and machine gun. I mean... Machine gun really doesn't matter to us. Please be a spreader. Hell yeah! Now we've got some firepower. Laser? No. You crazy? Oh shoot, yep. I forgot that thing fires at you super fast. So can we beat this game without using a continue? The answer is probably not, but... I mean, one way to find out... I mean, I could try grind off these guys. If I wanted to waste everyone's time. My own time included. Hell yeah! Back in the game. Fuck. Okay, now I vaguely remember this stage. Pretty sure that wall can't kill you, just narrows how much you can jump. And now we should be in the clear for the wall anyway. Now this just comes back here. I could totally believe that. Yep. Fucking knew it. Alright. Please excuse me as I take my time. Alright. Straight shot? Or is the wall gonna come crashing down again? I think we are in the clear. Okay, well we have to go down. I'm just worried that something's gonna fall on our head. And kill us because of that. Ooh, hello. What are we fighting? Oh! Final boss. Alright, cool. I know your pattern Contra 3, but is it similar to your pattern here? I hope it is. Okay, you don't seem to charge us this time, do you? I also can't tell if I'm doing damage or not. Booyah! I believe that is game, then. Hell yeah! Beat this game all rusty! <sighs> I can't think of the last time I actually beat Super C, because I played it for a race uh, a while back with a friend of mine who knows Super C like the back of his hand, or like Contra games in general like the back of his hand. Particularly the first two. And he kicked my ass in that race, and I didn't even bother to finish my run because I couldn't beat the game. So Because I hadn't played in a while at the time of doing that race. Like, I have beaten the game before, just 
not recently. Konami, and that's another game beaten for the list. 